Hey guys, welcome to this video and rumors are ripe that Samsung is working on a new Galaxy Watch. We don't know which one but they are working on something and we hope that they will come out with Samsung Galaxy Watch 2 next month when they announce their next Galaxy flagship S11 or S20 and we will talk about 7 things that we hope to see uh, in this watch. Now some of these things are we definitely will see, some of these we hope to see and some of these we wish to see. So let's talk about them. Now the first thing that I want to talk about is the screen size on Galaxy Watch 2. So Samsung Galaxy Watch right now has 1.3 inch screen and that is on the bigger 46mm version. But what we want to see is a bigger screen. The reason is Samsung Galaxy Watch Active 2 uh, in a 44mm frame has a 1.4 inch screen which is bigger than 1.3 inch screen on Samsung Galaxy Watch. So Samsung can definitely do better in the next version of Samsung Galaxy Watch 2. Two. So what we basically want is that Samsung keeps the size of the frame same for the 6mm but increase the screen size, stretch it out, narrow down the bezels but still keep the rotating bezel, just narrow it down. We all know that Samsung is capable of doing that and they should do it, maybe increase the screen size from 1.3 to 1.4 minimum or maybe go up to 1.6 that would just be brilliant now the next feature that we want to see in galaxy watch 2 is ecg now we know samsung announced ecg on galaxy watch active 2 which uh, after months of releasing we haven't seen yet so what we basically want is a uh, good to go ecg on galaxy watch 2 which should be on the watch when it is released and should be good to go uh, because that is something where the wearables are going towards now apple watch has it now we think this is coming out with the smart watches that have ecg support even samsung announced it for galaxy watch active 2 but we haven't seen it yet now the next thing that i want to talk about is a compass on samsung galaxy watch 2 now compass by itself no one is ever going to use it but compass can be really useful when navigating and apple watch recently announced it in their uh, apple watch series 5 it is really really useful when it comes to navigation so what you can basically do is you can just start navigating on your phone put your phone in your pocket and then you can just use the watch to see which way you're going at least you know which way you're facing and if you're going in the right direction and that is something that can come in really handy on galaxy watches and hopefully samsung will announce and put in a compass in the next galaxy watch Moving on, the next thing I want to talk about is the accelerometer. So when Samsung announced Samsung Galaxy Watch Active 2, uh, they announced a new and faster accelerometer which was twice as fast as the last Galaxy Watch Active. So hopefully we will see a new and faster and improved accelerometer on Galaxy Watch 2. So what it basically does is that it improves the activity tracking on the watch and improves the detection of these activities as well. So with this new and improved um, accelerometer, what I hope to see is another feature that Apple announced on Apple Watch Series 5 and that was fall detection. So whenever there is a fall, the watch detects that the user has fallen for whatever reason and then calls the emergency services automatically. Now this feature can really be a lifesaver in certain circumstances and so Samsung should include it in the next Galaxy Watch 2. Uh, if they really hope to compete with Apple watches in a wearable space. Next up what I want to see and hopefully we will see it on the next Galaxy watch is a new and improved heart rate sensor. So again as with the accelerometer when Samsung announced Galaxy watch active 2 they announced a new and improved heart rate sensor. So right now uh, Galaxy watch has four LEDs uh, to detect the heart rate uh, and take the heart rate measurement and with uh, Galaxy Watch Active 2 we have 8 LEDs that does the same job so they measure the heart rate much more accurately. So hopefully Samsung will give us a new and improved heart rate sensor on our Galaxy Watch 2 as well just as we have on Samsung Galaxy Watch Active 2. Now moving on I want to talk about the battery life. Now Galaxy Watch already has a pretty good battery life. It has a 472 mAh battery inside a 46mm watch and with this battery capacity you can get 4 days of battery life out of Galaxy Watch. Now whether they can increase the battery capacity or not because obviously it's a small frame as compared to phones and there is less space to expand the battery uh, when we want a better heart rate sensor as well and SpO2 sensor as well and we want ECG support as well. I'm not sure if they'll be able to increase the battery capacity. 
uh, but we need an improved battery life and it's basically a dream to get that seven day battery life at least and if samsung can you know make some magic happen here and improve the battery life on top of what we are already getting from samsung galaxy watch it would be just amazing it would be really great to hit that seven day mark um, on your watches because nobody wants to charge their watch every night it's a hassle and uh, we really want to see that improved battery life in the next galaxy watch and finally and i'm pretty sure that this uh, feature will be available in the next galaxy watch whichever one it will be it's bluetooth 5 and i've talked about bluetooth 5 versus bluetooth 4.2 and its advantages better connectivity better range better speeds of transfer and uh, you can connect two headphones at the same time and then uh, obviously low energy consumption which again can improve the battery life of the watch as well so i'm pretty sure because galaxy watch active 2 has loaded 5 so there is no doubt in my mind that the next galaxy watch if it's watch 2 or any other watch will have bluetooth 5 and i'm really glad that we're moving on to this technology finally so that's about it from this video guys let me know about your thoughts about any updates or any new features that you want to see in the next galaxy watch in the comments and i will see you in the next video till then take care Bye bye